Hello everyone, Eric here with the Hobby Farm Guys. Today, thanks to a request by C. Farnwide down in Utah, we turned the spotlight on a chicken breed that is skyrocketing in popularity due to the dark, rich colored eggs they lay, the Copper Moran. Moran chickens originated in the French port town of Moran, located in the Bay of Biscay in southern France. Local land race birds, often referred to as swamp chickens, due to the marshy, low-level countryside they thrived in, were crossed with game cocks from India and Indonesia, creating what became known as Merandice fowl. Over time, additional breeds such as Brahmas, Crowed Langshan, and others were added to the mix to create the Moran we know today. Pronunciation of the breed name is all over the place. If you look at French language rules, the S is silent and so pronounced Moran. Several varieties are available such as the Cuckoo, Wheaton, and Colombian. Moran can be clean-legged or feather-legged. In Britain, the standard recognizes only clean-legged. In the United States and France, it's all about the feathers. And in Australia, take your pick as both are recognized. Although different countries have different standards when it comes to Moran, they are generally classified as large type fowl of continental breed. Originally popular in France due to the large, deep colored eggs they produce, Morans nearly went extinct following World War II. The French Department of Agriculture rescued them from obscurity and began a breeding program with the goal of increasing egg production, which it did. By 1952, Morans were producing up to 200 eggs per year. It's worth noting that as egg production increases, the deep color of the egg fades. The black copper morans sport a body which is strong, long, and sturdy, and they should be wide through the shoulders. They have remarkable plumage. The overall body feathers are deep black, which can have a green iridescence in the sunlight. The hackle feathers are a reddish copper tone. The rooster also has copper saddle feathers that cascade over the back, and while the hen isn't as fancy She's still a beautiful bird. Males weigh around seven to eight pounds and hens about six and a half pounds. There are bantam morans, but they're quite rare. The single comb, waddles, ears, and face are all red. The beak is strong with a slight hook to it and it should be horn colored. The eyes are orange and the shanks and feet are slate or pink. Black copper morans are quiet and gentle Although their gamecock heritage can lead to roosters which are confrontational, though that's not always the case. Moran hens are docile, though this can vary from bird to bird, and they aren't known as a cuddly breed. They may be noisy or quiet depending on the bird. Morans are an active breed that enjoy foraging and free ranging, but they'll tolerate confinement fairly well. They're also suitable to colder climates if given adequate shelter though their large combs are susceptible to frostbite. Morans lay a dark brown egg, but the black copper is sought after as the eggs can be very dark chocolate. The fewer eggs a hen lays, the darker they are. The pigment that produces the brown color is finite, so as she ages, the ink in the well may start to run dry, producing lighter eggs. Egg quality is unsurpassed. In fact, 007 himself, James Bond, is known to eat only Moran eggs. The Moran Society developed a scale for the color of eggs ranging from 1 to 9, with 9 being the darkest. A hen that lays eggs lighter than a 4 is not considered to be a Moran. If you want to acquire Morans, be prepared to part with some serious money. While they can be bought for $10, if you want the dark colored eggs, you'll pay much more. Make sure to find a reputable breeder, and remember, you get what you pay for. So there you have it, the Black Copper Moran Chicken. A great looking dual purpose bird that lays rich dark brown colored eggs. Let us know your thoughts and suggestions in the comments below. And until next time, keep on hobby farming.